Hey, what's going on guys? It's CJ. I'm going to show you how to clean an electric stove, how to clean specifically these silver trays where they're underneath of the coils. And one thing I'm going to show you first is how to actually lift up this here. So you have a locking mechanism. So kids, you know, don't touch anything, but basically it's just to lift it. So you're going to unlock this and then it actually says clean right there. So you can lift this up. So now that it's lifted up, you want to lift it to where it locks in the place with the two bars, the supporting bars, it locks in the place. And you can see there's some pasta, you got some uh, pasta under there. And then this can all just be wiped. And now if you want to clean the top to close this, you have to lift it up, but you actually have to push these in at the same time. You have to push the bar in as you lift up so that it can go back down under and then you drop it down like that okay to clean the silver trays you want to pull out the burner yes the burner actually pulls out so you're simply just going to lift up and pull it straight out just like that it's that simple two connectors that go right into here and then you can simply just pull this tray off and clean it with soap and water and then you can do that to all of them. Just lift up, pull it out. So you can get Barkeeper's Friend. They have it in powder and liquid form. Just sprinkle it all around and then just get one of the scrub brushes and go ahead and let it sit for a little bit with water and all this stuff should come right up. Okay, once you cleaned your uh, stainless steel trays, you're just going to make sure that you line this up with the whole opening to the connector. Get one of your coils and go ahead and put it in on an angle. Line your two connector pieces straight in where the opening is and then put it in on a slight angle. You're going to lift up and kind of push it in. You'll feel it go in and then this last piece here is this little metal tab. It's going to rest right inside there so it doesn't move it's in tight and the way you know you got it on right is if you turn on the burner on the back here the four dots indicates where which burner you're using so the color dot would be the burner dial that you're working on so this is the front right i'm going to turn it on burner lights on just place your hand over top feel if you feeling i feel heat coming out right now so that, that is on, that is correct. Two large and two small burners. You really can't mess that up. I don't know if that's the same for your electric stove, but that's how you do that with this one. Like, subscribe, and comment, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.